Hey everyone, how are you doing this morning? Hopefully everyone is doing well. I'm coming to you barefaced to show you some skincare products and this is going to be one of my spotlight on cruelty-free company days. This is on a company that I know is very popular but it's a company that I am not familiar with. Never tried any products before from this company. This is actually the first time. The company's name is Dr. Hauschka. I know a lot of people are very familiar with Dr. Hauschka. Dr. Hauschka's company was very interesting to me when I read about it. I believe their products are manufactured in Germany. It was all started in the 60s, I believe. I think it was 1967 when Dr. Hauschka got involved in starting this company. And the company makes both skincare and makeup. From my understanding, I believe they are actually made in Germany at a homeopathic pharmaceutical company. Dr. Hauschka's line is more of a holistic homeopathic line. He wanted to promote more natural beauty with organic ingredients. He was very much concerned about the health and welfare of people and also concerned about the planet. His products are 100% natural, very healing, very soothing for the skin, and he had very much a holistic approach to making his products. And I'm just going to show you just a very few of his products because if you look at the website for Dr. Hauschka, they have a very extensive line of skincare and also makeup. I only have a tiny sampling from them, but I thought it would be fun to spot spotlight them because they are a cruelty-free company. Let me show you some of the products that I was sent and I'll just give you a little information on them and I'll do a quick demonstration. So I am going to go over some of these products. I'm also going to tell you which of the ones really stood out to me as products that I really liked, products that I personally would buy myself. The first product is the Dr. Hauschka Cleansing Cream. I I'm a big cleanser. I double cleanse my skin. I wear a lot of sunscreen during the day and it's very hard to get that mineral sunscreen off. This cleansing cream is supposed to refine, revitalize, and deeply clean your skin. It says it's for all skin types. It contains calendula, anthelius, I think that's how you pronounce that, and sweet almond meal. And it's supposed to cleanse and balance the skin, revitalize the skin and make it healthy and radiant. This was a very interesting product for me because I have never seen a cleansing cream of this consistency. I guess the best way to describe it would be like oatmeal paste. This was a really soothing cleansing cream. Now for me, this would not be a cleansing cream I would use on my face to remove makeup or to remove my mineral sunscreen because that stuff is really hard to get off my face. What I normally do is I go in at night, use a cleansing cream makeup remover, and then once I'm sure all my makeup's been removed, I go in a second time with whichever cleanser I want to use. This cleanser I've been testing out at night. This would be a great cleanser for any skin type, especially sensitive skin. It would be very good for dry mature skin. It does come out like a paste. And the scent I don't know how to describe the scent of their products. Their products have kind of a medicinal scent, almost like a medicine. They're very natural and organic smelling, but they do smell more on the medicinal side. You're not going to get a scent of perfume or flowers or sweetness or citrus or anything like that. So I just wanted to let you know that I did get used to the scent. It didn't bother me at all, but I just wanted to mention that because sometimes when people take 
off the cap. They're expecting a perfume or fragrance. These products don't have that. This comes out like an oatmeal paste. And what I did was I would just wet my face and then put a little bit of the paste on the palm of my hand and then wet that and then rub that all over my face, massage it into my skin. This does feel like you're putting on sort of an oatmeal treatment on your face. It is slightly exfoliating, but not really exfoliating. You do feel a little bit kind of a soft oatmeal texture to the cleanser, but it's not rough. It is super gentle. It would be good for any skin type. Really, I think good for dry skin. Now, when I applied mine, I massaged it in with my silicone facial brush that felt so good. And then you can just wipe it off with either warm water in your hands or with a cleansing cloth. The next product from Dr. Hauschka that I also really liked was their facial toner. I am a believer in facial toner. I love using toners on my skin. I know sometimes people say they're not necessary, but I really do like using a toner. I feel it does help my skin. I know you can't really tighten your pores, but it just feels like it is cleaning out my pores, refreshing my face. It says on the box that the facial toner should enliven and fortify the skin. It is 100% certified natural, free from synthetic fragrances, dyes, and preservatives. This is for normal, dry, and sensitive skin. It contains anthelius, I believe I'm pronouncing that right, with witch hazel. It helps to refine the pores and helps to support skin's natural firmness and elasticity. This would be my second most favorite product of the bunch. You just shake it up. It is a spray and it is such a fine mist. I just squirt this over my face and over my neck super refreshing. I actually love the scent of this product. You can actually put this on your decolletage and then all I do is just press this in to my skin. Leaves my skin feeling and looking so healthy and radiant. I have a lot of misters that I use on my skin. This facial toner mister is probably one of my favorite. Super fine mist and it really feels like it enlivened my skin. The scent is different. It is so pleasant. This would probably be my first favorite product. The third most favorite product that I have from Dr. Hauschka is this. This is a hydrating cream mask. I am a big believer in using hydrating cream masks. I live in Colorado, live in a really dry climate. I love putting these hydrating masks on my skin, leaving them on for either hours or overnight. And then when I wake up the next morning, my skin feels so moisturized, hydrated, soft, and not dry. It says that this is an intensive hydrating cream mask. It will richly moisturize the skin, replenish the skin. It's for dry, sensitive, and mature skin. It contains quince seed and almond oil that helps replenish the skin and also rose wax, which gently envelops and protects the skin. I think if I had to put them in order of my favorites, the first one would be that facial toner. That felt so good and it almost actually felt like it was tightening my pores. I know in reality, there is no tightening of pores really. My second most favorite product is this hydrating cream mask. I've been using this this week. Now, I really don't detect any scent on this one at all. This product is probably one of the most emollient, rich, hydrating masks I think I've ever tried. Really on the top of my list for products to hydrate my skin. I wouldn't necessarily put this on and go out right away because it really is a very thick mask. I would put this on my skin overnight and just let all 
all these ingredients soak in and get rid of any dryness. This is a great product to use if you're using also Retin-A. Really does help with all the flaking that you can get from it. This is just so emollient. Feels lovely. <laughs> lovely on my skin. Makes it so soft and supple. Really great for dry mature skin. This would be a product I definitely would purchase. Finally, two other products from Dr. Hauschka. One is their Regenerating Day Cream. It says that this is smoothing facial care with mineral pigments that helps to balance out your skin tone. It also says it's for the specific needs of mature skin. It contains light reflecting pigments that create a vibrant radiance. I would consider this product more of a cream. You apply this to the face each morning after cleansing and toning the skin. This is not a tinted moisturizer. It is a very, very, very light moisturizing cream that does have a little bit of pigment in it, but not enough pigment to give you something like a BB cream would or a normal tinted uh, moisturizer would give you. This is extremely light. It's something that I would put on my skin just to make it look beautiful or I would add it to a tinted moisturizer or a BB cream or a CC cream to give the skin some of the moisturizing properties and also light reflecting properties of this product. It is slightly tinted. It is so light, it won't cover up um, any uh, imperfections that you really have in your skin. It's more of a product that when you rub it in, I don't know if you can see those light reflecting properties. It makes the skin just glow. Makes the skin look so healthy. And those light reflecting properties do help to make the fine lines and wrinkles on your face look more camouflaged. It doesn't have enough color to it to really do a lot of work on people that have major imperfections in their skin or hyperpigmentation. The scent of this to me, more of a like a licorice root scent. That's what I'm getting from this product. This product is really nice if you want to either use it alone on bare skin to make your skin look really healthy looking. But I think the best way to use this might be to mix it with a tinted moisturizer for those people that have a little bit more imperfections in their skin or who really want to even out their skin tone a lot and give the CC cream or BB cream or tinted moisturizer using or for foundation you're using, add that to it to make your skin glow and look beautiful and radiant. That was Dr. Hauschka's Regenerating Day Cream Complex. And finally, the last product from Dr. Hauschka is a translucent bronzing tint. Now I have tried products like this before on my skin. It's a liquid bronzing tint. It says you can mix this with a moisturizer. I actually added it alone on my skin. It says to mix it with a moisturizer. You can also add it to a foundation. It gives you a healthy sun-kissed glow. It's a mineral tint that blends and softens the appearance of blemishes and imperfections. And it's just called Dr. Hauschka's Fluido Bronzelador. I always like products that give my skin a sun-kissed glow, make it look healthy looking. This was a very fast drying product. Really did find this interesting. It has a pump on it. That is the color that it comes out. And then if you rub that in, you can see it's not as dark as it looks when you first see it. It shouldn't be really an overwhelming tint, not a scary bronzing tint at all. It just gives a very light, healthy, sun-kissed glow to the skin. Makes the skin look really hydrated, soft, 
and dewy. I found this to be a beautiful bronzing tint. The reason I liked it was it was so lightweight, wasn't heavy at all, and wasn't so dark that it looked unnatural. So I have been really pleased with the products from Dr. Hauschka. I was so thrilled I was able to show and demonstrate products from another company that is cruelty free. Dr. Hauschka's company is very concerned about the health of the skin. A whole holistic approach to skincare and makeup, homeopathic, and actually produced in Germany by a homeopathic pharmaceutical company. Take care, guys. Talk to you soon. Thank you, Dr. Hauschka. And I also believe Dr. Hauschka's company is involved in fair trade projects. I will leave a link to information on that if I can find it also down in the description box. Take care, guys. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye from Orla.